Developed in the late 80s, electronic stability control has become a mainstay in the automotive industry. Today we're at the Southern Hemisphere Proving Ground in New Zealand to put the technology to the test. So we need a car fitted with ESC, so we have the new Holden Insignia VXR. We also need a professional driver, and that's where James Courtney, V8 supercar driver, steps in. James, today we're going to take the Holden Insignia VXR, we're going to turn off all stability control programs, and I'm gonna get you to punt it into those witches hats in an emergency lane change. And the whole idea is for you to show us how good you are at controlling the car in these uncontrollable conditions. And then we'll try it again with it on so everyone can see just how well it works. Now we don't have much ice in Australia or snowy conditions, so this is designed to really test the car at its limits. Do you reckon you're up for it? I'll give it a crack. All right, let's give it a shot. Okay, so everything is switched off, all the stability controls. We've pulled a fuse for ABS. This is going to be like an old car and everything is going to go wrong. So this is a controlled environment and this is a worst case scenario. So I want you to get to about 70 k's an hour and Even try, and, there, uh, <laughs> try and avoid killing us, please. God, this is much scarier than it looks. Oh, wow. <laughs> We're not even turning. <laughs> I think we've just, <laughs> we've just killed gone through the car cars. park. <laughs> Taking out a whole right. car park of I think we need to give that another shot this time with everything back on. Okay, so let's try this again. We're going to switch everything back on and now the stability control system is gonna manage it all. So when you start doing your swerve, the nannies are gonna kick in, they'll break individually, you know, each wheel and it will keep you going in the correct direction. So hopefully this time around, we'll find that the car doesn't kill anything. So let's give it a shot. Back up to 70 and then uh, try your hardest to make it Stay straight. <laughs> wow, look at that. <laughs> you didn't kill any cones. We've safely come to a stop, avoided, you know, the moose everything. or the child, <laughs> <laughs> everything. Um, that, that is amazing tech, right? It's really impressive. Um, that just shows that uh, even us professional drivers can do with the assistance from time to time. Exactly, and I think that's what everyone has to remember. It's not hard to see why ESC is now mandatory on all new cars and SUVs sold in Australia from November 2013. As you saw over there, this technology could one day save your life. So if you're in the market for a used car, make sure it comes with this life-saving technology.